as the U.S. men's soccer team faced Iran in what would be an elimination match for one of them. Fans crowded in the local pubs to watch the game. When the U.S. team scored their first game-winning goal, the crowd at Misconduct Tavern went crazy. Hell of a match. Uh, they did what they had to do. They got the three points, came out of it, go on. Now we play the Netherlands. Hey, see what happens there. They're beatable. These matches are more than just a sporting event. They are a source of national pride and identity. Awesome performance by the States. Brilliant. Hey, we got Bedford Messi. We got Zimmerman. We got Britt. Reem making some awesome, awesome defensive plays. Brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Great game. Uh, happy to see the U.S. take a W tonight. It was just uh, great to see. Earlier in the week, Iran called for the U.S. team to be kicked out of the World Cup. This came after the U.S. Soccer Federation removed the emblem on the Iranian flag in two social media posts for 24 hours to show solidarity for the ongoing anti-Iranian government protest. On the field, Iranian players collapsed in grief as their run ended. However, in Iran, crowds gathered to celebrate the U.S. victory over their national team, rebuking the oppressive regime. The U.S.'s win over Iran today advances them to the next round. Starting Saturday, there will be three more rounds of the tournament until the World Cup Finals played on December 18th. The round of 16 begins at 10 a.m. on Saturday with the U.S. team going up against the Netherlands. Reporting for Temple Update, I'm Brian Mangini.